Today is uh, Tuesday, August 20th, and we're walking in the bee field. Uh, this video, we're going to take you and do a little soybean, soybean scouting of all of our Z series that we planted and do some pod counts and just uh, compare them to the beans that we got and plan next to. Now, the 3 7 is the only one we were able to split plant and do it throughout the whole field. The rest, we just had to plant them next to each other because they the 3 7s the only one we had the same maturity in. Right here is not too hard to find where the variety changes. We got as close as we could in maturity. We planted a, two, a 28A 65E, both Enlist beans, of course. You can spray with Enlist, Liberty, or Dicamba. Or, sorry, Enlist, Liberty, or Roundup. And this is the closest we could get. This 2.8 we had some luck with last year, so I had to plant again. And right here, we have the new 32Z91E. So, yeah, as you can see, the 2.8s, of course, are getting ready first. So, let's just do a little comparison, shall we? We're going to take uh, just a random bean here. Not seeing any disease in it. Looks good. Bugs has been feeding a little bit. Of course, we spray everything with fungicide, so that definitely helps that all out. It's going to take a random plant out of the three twos. And let's take a random plant out of the two eights that are still pretty green because they'll probably be better. All right, got our findings. I should probably also mention we plant all at 125,000 population, which is what we do. We find that planting them early and planting them thin there seems to be working out for us. All right here we have the pile for the... Uh, 28A65 with 62 pods with three of them, 29 with two, then four with just one, which gave us a total of 248 beans on that plant. Of course, there's just one plant in the field. It's kind of, you know, don't really tell you much, but maybe give you an idea. And on the 32Z91s, we actually had five four potters or four bean pods, so that was good to see. 76 three potters and 21 two beans per pod and uh none with one give us a total of 290 so just on these two plants selected at random nowhere near the best part of the field but not a bad part of the field the 28 had 248 total beans on it while the 32z had 290 so those two plants that's a win tip for the Z series. Now I'm gonna head just over the hill and combine and compare a 3-5 Z series to a 3-4A series. And this 3-4A is pretty good, so that one's gonna be tough to beat. So let's go, let's see what we find out, shall we? In the middle of another big, this is a big bean field here. It's 236 acres. Got a few things in here. Plant out the 32 Z91s on the in rows. Plant what we had of the 35 Z76 here. And plant just a four, a little bit right beside them of the 34A89E, which has been a very, very good bean. So I'm in the 34As here. Got my app out because they're definitely. Can't tell the naked eye what's what. I'm gonna pull one at random here, then I'm gonna go over and pull a 35Z. Of course, they're still putting on pods, these later ones, but you know, gotta check it sometime. I'll be harvest here for long. All right, the results are in and they are a little disappointing but they're still putting pods on i thought these would be better but these are both worse especially the three four but hopefully i just got dud it's one plant i mean like the two eights had 248 three twos had 290 come over here to 34 a 89 we had 38 three pods 22 two pods and two one potters for a total of 160 then you come over here to the 35Z76. We have 46 three potters, 25 two potters, and one, one bean a pod for a total of 189. So another win for Z series. 
Hopefully it's got some uh, bad ones. They were hard to work through, uh, walk through out there. They're leaning over a little bit, but I've definitely seen worse. But what do you expect when you're trying to walk through a bush, a plant that's a bush? So that's two of our tests. We still have a 3.7Z versus a 3.7A to go and a 4.2A against a 4.0Z. That's close as I can get on that one. But we'll have to do that in our day because they're in a different spot and I gotta go meet a guy. So we'll get to those on another day. Today's Monday, 26th of August. I was up by Robinson, Illinois, doing some other stuff. Besides so top by this Z-Series test. They're both supposed to be three seven, so we split the planter all the way across. So, so this should be the best Z-Series test we have this year. You can tell one's definitely ripening up a little bit more than the other. On this side, it's a little taller. And it's starting to yellow faster, so it's just a hair bit earlier. And that's the new 37Z06E. And here's one that we played last year we like. It's great on sudden death. I know that for sure on a test we did. It is 37A18E. So let's pull a couple uh, random plants and uh, do some more pod count. Okay, the results of this one's in. I should probably mention we've had really good growing weather until like the last three weeks we haven't got any rain which the first two weeks of that went too bad because at least it wasn't hot beginning of last week and this week is hot and dry and i think soybeans are yields definitely starting to be affected a little bit now but it's good grounded up here have a lot of hope for it generally year in year out the mid to late group threes is where we have the most success on yield so to the results the 37z06 had 71 three potters, no four potters. 34 two potters and had three with just one bean in them. And the, and the 37A18 had 55 with three beans in a pod and 41 with two beans in a pod. Our grand total ended up the Z series one again for the third time. Uh, it had 284 total beans on this random plant and the A series had 247. So. Z series for the win again and we got one more to check out i'll do that in indiana sometime and their maturities it's it's a field that's split because they're we can't get anything exact the z series is a 4-0 and the uh, a series is a 4-2 so we'll get to that one another day it is wednesday august 28th we're over here in one of our indiana farms southern knox county and we're doing our last side by side uh Soybean count on these Z series soybeans versus A series. Uh, these beans are irrigated. I don't know if you can see the irrigation over there running. We did get a little bit of rain. That's good because it's been hot and dry. We got a half, about a half inch in this spot, an inch down the river, then two tenths of home, and I don't think anything in the north, but anything could help. Today we got uh, on this side 42A, 84E. In the new 40Z 57E. So there is a little bit of maturity difference here. Uh, can't tell it yet, but uh, this is a, this is the closest that we had to the 4.0. We had a 4.2. That's it's been real good, just like our other beans. So we're gonna pull a couple of random like we've been doing and do a bean count and see what we have. Of course, these are just random plants. Don't tell you a whole lot, maybe give you an idea, and then uh, then the combine will tell the story here for long on the next one of these videos. All right, the results are in. It's another Z series win. I feel like I really need to stress these are just random plants. I could have just got a really good Z series one here and a dud of a A series, but we'll just go with the random plants that we picked. Uh, the Z series had 78 pods. With three beans in them, 72, which I think is the most I've seen, with two in them, and seven single ones. While the A-Series had 55 with three, and 29 with two, and no singles. Uh, ended up 385 total beans on the Z-Series, and 223 on the A-Series. And these were planted 125,000 plants per acre, just, just like the rest. So, 
that's the results everywhere we've checked the z-series is better then when we get the combine out we'll find out for sure they really are better which i think they're going to be they all look good beans look good uh where they're not irrigated they you can definitely tell where the irrigation goes you get outside of it they're not looking as good right now but hopefully this last rain perked them up a little bit so looking forward to seeing what the combine says so till then this is it for the z-series videos until harvest